So Tachyon got a ton of new support and it's absolutely insane. What if I told you guys a single card leads to an FDK with this brand new support? It's absolutely insane. I don't know how Konami is going to let this play out in the TCG because I'm telling you, it's a one card combo and it FDKs your opponent. And in today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys what the FDK looks like and something we might actually see come to the Yu-Gi-Oh! TCG very, very soon. So with that being said, let's get right into the video. So I'm going to be showing you guys how absolutely crazy this one card FTK, literally an FTK, this is not clickbait, it's a one card FTK, it's absolutely insane, and it uses the new Tachyon support. I'm going to go through the support with you guys real quick just to show you guys what some of the cards do and how it's going to be able to FTK, and I'm going to be showing you guys that FTK in just a little bit here, alright? So the first thing is, I'm going to move my face cam so that you guys can actually see the text of the cards over here. The first thing is our Galaxy Eyes Tachyon Primal. So its first effect is when a Dragon Ixies monster declares an attack you can attach this card from the field to it as a material that's pretty cool that's not the important part though the two important effects are if a dragon exceeds monsters on the field quick effect you can special summon this card from your hand to either side of the field in this case you're going to be wanting summoning it to your side of the field for the fdk and then the other effect where it gets insanely powerful is if this card is normal or special summoned its owner adds one tachyon spell or trap from their deck to their hand so this is going to be really nice because it's going to be able to search the brand new seventh tachyon this card is absolutely insane as well so you reveal a number Ixies monster in your extra deck that has a number between 101 and 107 in its name and then what you can do is add a monster with the same type and or attribute as a revealed monster and it has to have a level equal to the rank of the revealed monster and then you can add it essentially to your hand okay so that is absolutely insane then you have to place one card from your hand to the top of your deck and that's not really important because you're going to be playing off with five cards anyways to start the game right so then that's fine but the main thing is you're going to be able to add a card and you guys can already see we have catapult turtle over here we're literally using a card from 2002 to ftk our opponents all right and um the card to search catapult turtle by the way it's a level five water aqua this is a rank five water aqua so you can actually use your c101 to search the catapult turtle all right so that's how the ftk is going to be made and then lastly we have the schwartz child infinity dragon now while this is not a tachyon card it is level eight dragon support that lets you special summon it to your side of the field when you control no monsters you can special summon another level level 8 monster this is when you get your galactic spiral dragon and start a lot of your combos so it's essentially just a level 8 starter for you that's really really powerful now lastly the new card here is a dragaluxion i'm hoping i'm saying that right essentially it's two level 8 monsters if it's special summon from the extra deck you can add a galaxy or tachyon card from your deck to your hand so it doesn't have to be a monster it can be any card and that's why this is so powerful because what i'm gonna be showing you guys is a one card ftk but if you open like two cards of these then you can search additional cards which helps the fdk become a lot more viable but uh yeah so it searches any galaxy or tachyon card then you can detach two materials from this card special summon a rank eight dragon ixies monster with 3000 attack from your extra deck and then you use this card as a material right then you can also attach another galaxy card from your extra deck into it as a material as well if you wanted to drop two materials on that that's not as important for the fdk but it does come up here and there all right so that is all the new cards and you guys are going to be seeing there's a lot of big dragon cards over here i really want to show you guys what this FTK looks like and it uses a single card so like I said earlier this combo literally just requires a single card to get going and that is your Schwarzschild infinity dragon this card is absolutely insane and then of course you need any other card for your seventh tachyon to put into your deck but that's fine that's not a problem because you're gonna be it's an FTK right you're going first and you're gonna be able to FTK your opponent so you're gonna have five cards in your hand always right so it doesn't matter what that second card is it's the first card over here which is your Schwarzschild infinity dragon right so we're gonna activate its effect we're going to special summon it to our side of the field and we're going to use its effect now to special summon our galactic spiral dragon all right so we're going to summon that and then what we're going to be able to do is use these two monsters to make the brand new dragluxion because this is going to get our new primal tachyon or galaxy eyes tachyon primal to our hand all right so it's going to search our tachyon primal now keep in mind like i said earlier if you already open this you can just search the spell right away you don't have to necessarily search this if you open the spell you know what i mean like you search the monster and you do all these different things so there's different ways to do it but as long as you open to that one card and you get to this monster on your side of the field you're going to be able to fdk right so now what you're going to do is you're going to activate your tachyon primal and you're going to special summon this card to your field all right not your opponent's field that's important because you're going to be using it for uh rank a monster later and then you're going to be able to use this effect of course to search the seventh tachyon all right so this is very very important we could actually just right away activate this but we're going to hold it for now what we're going to do is you're going to use our drag luxion detach two cards over here 
to be able to special summon our Dragalubion. This is one of the most important pieces for you guys. So summon your Dragalubion over here, and then you're going to be able to attach another Galaxy material on it. You don't have to. You could if you want to. You don't have to if you don't want to commit all that extra deck space. Then what you're going to do is use your Galaxy uh, or Galactic Spiral Dragon, I should say, summon it to your side of the field. Use these two monsters now to make a Hope Harbinger, all right? Then what you're gonna do is you are, now you can use this, let's let's use the seventh Tachyon, it doesn't really matter, I guess, the order as much, but you're gonna reveal the C101 over here to, of course, be able to search your Catapult Dragon, so, or Catapult Turtle, I should say, all the way back to 2002, which is absolutely crazy. Put that Goblin back into your deck, you don't need it. You're gonna activate your Draglubion now, detaching the Dragluxion over here to summon your number 100 Numeron Dragon, and then uh, you can put anything under it as a material, all right? So number 100 over here, and then you're gonna activate its effect now its effect says it gains a thousand attack combined based off of the ranks of the monsters on your side of the field so it's a rank 8 rank 8 so that's 16,000, 17,000 over here, right? So you're gonna detach this, it's gonna become 17,000 attack. You're now gonna be able to summon your Catapult Turtle. Now, Catapult Turtle, if you guys don't know, you tribute a monster and then you inflict damage to your opponent's life points equal to half of the monster's attack. Keep in mind, we still haven't used our normal summon. So at this point, you can just normal summon uh, your Catapult Turtle. And I like to keep Hope Harbinger on my side of the field just in case my opponent somehow survives this FTK, they have a card to survive it. But, uh, you know, you, you guys don't have to keep this. You can tribute this, keep the Jaglubi on. If you put another material, potentially next turn, you can summon another card. I just like to keep the whole Harbinger, of course. We're gonna activate our Catapult Turtle, tributing the number, the Numeron Dragon, the number 100. You're gonna do 8,500 damage. 17,000 divided by two is 8,500, and you're FTKing your opponent with a single card using Catapult Turtle. Tell me this is not insane. And the craziest part about this is I showed it to you guys as a one card combo, but if you're able to get to rank eight monsters and have rank eight extenders, you can actually get to this combo without just that one card. If you get stopped on that one card, let's say you use an Imperm, and then you have a rank eight extender from your hand, you summon that, you still make the Dragluxion, and you can still combo from there, which is absolutely insane. And you're gonna be able to catapult Turtle and go for game. It's absolutely insane that a card from 2002 is enabling FTKs in 2024. Could we see catapult Turtle banned? I don't know, but this is absolutely crazy. So that is it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed. That is the one card Tachyon FDK post support. I don't remember when the support is supposed to be coming out, but when this support does come out, it leads to a single one card FTK. Absolutely insane the fact that you're able to do this with Tachyon and it's so consistent, which is the most crazy part about it. Now, if you guys enjoyed today's video, make sure to like the video and subscribe to the channel for more Yu-Gi-Oh content just like this one. We upload seven days a week here on the channel. You guys get five shorts and at least two videos like this one, whether it's a combo video, a deck profile, you guys got product openings, all that good stuff. I post it right here on the channel. So make sure you guys subscribe to stay tuned to all of that. I appreciate every one of you. Thank you guys all for watching. And with that, Spanko signing out. Peace.